Welcome back to Living Life Barefoot. Today's video, we are gonna be taking our sheep to the butcher. So we just wanted to share with you our systems here that we use, since we don't have an enclosed trailer to haul the sheep. So the last couple years, Corey's made this makeshift cage that fits right into the back of our truck. Just last night, he built that revolving door on the front. Hopefully that'll make it easier for us. I'll go ahead and show you kind of our setup here. So I'll just kind of show you a close up here of what he put together. Fits in the back of the truck with these fence panels. And then he built this just last night. So this is the first time we're gonna be trying this out. Dylan, you wanna show him how it works? Yep. Little sliding door there. So once we get him in, we can shut the door real quick and get the next one. I think we have six that were taken to the processor today. Ready? Okay, right now they're going to screw this board up in our shed so we can put our little feed troughs in here. This is the shed we're gonna get them all into so then we can get them from there into the back of the truck. And Ralph is just gonna sit here and take all the love. <laughs> And his big, nice, warm dog house. <laughs> oh, you just like a big tower. Oh. Put it about in the middle. You need towels too. Oh, you need that. You need this. He's just like a big pillow. Like a big teddy bear. Little update on the mamas and their new babies. They seem to be doing really good. We haven't been able to get close enough yet to see if we have boys or girls. So hopefully the boys are definitely anxious to get a hold of those babies and hold them for a little bit. Okay, what are we using these for? Well, anybody that's dealt with livestock at all knows that the easiest way to get them to comply is with food. So we're going to lure them into the sheep shelter with some sweet feed. And then we're going to use these to trap them in and make a little chute that goes to the, to the back of the truck. So you can lift them up, throw them in the back of the truck. Do you think this is going to go really smooth? It always does. <laughs> Six years in a row now we've done this and uh, there's always a little hiccup but it always works out. Last year, um, when we tried this, um, our dad, he got bulldozed by one of the sheep. Uh-oh, you think that's going to happen today? Maybe. We shall see. All right, Gavin and I are on sheep duty while Corey goes and gets the truck. Gavin, 
How good do you think this is gonna go today? Um, good thoughts, right? It's gonna go perfectly fine. Good thoughts, but uh, every year at least one gets out. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. We got this. If all else fails, y'all get out of the way and mama will take over. <laughs> so far. We're just trying to get them separated right now. There you go. Good mama. Come on, big boy. Ready? Let's shut it. There you go. Good mama. Good mama. Good mama. We start back at square one. I think Dad's really mad. Yeah, Corey had to walk off. Yeah. We'll get it.
big man is a uh, monster. Huh? He's a monster. Yeah, he's big. He usually go. He's usually sticking around the girls. So I don't know why he's not wanting. Okay, we got five out of the six. We have one wounded, meaning Gavin. Got his hand smashed between the two gates. And then the last male got out, so you all right? Yeah, it hurts though. We got four out of the five, so we're just gonna go ahead and take these four in and maybe take the other one in a different day. We'll see what happens, but this worked out pretty good with just the four of us here. Gavin did get hurt, but he'll be okay. Um, this works out really well if you don't have access to a stop trailer. And it was just things that we, like I said, had around, material we had around here. Corey just kind of put together. All right, off they go to the butcher. Them was some heavy things. Two of them were really heavy. They're about a month farther along than they normally are when we take them in, so they've had another month to put on weight, and they were very, very heavy. Thanks for watching, guys. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you like and share our videos. Peace out.